Good morning, everyone. This is Sajin with you from the Doc Training web series. Today, I'll be demonstrating the capability of copying pages in SharePoint Online or Doc. Uh, please know that this only works for your SharePoint Online instance, um, and I hope you know that there's no other easy way to copy pages in SharePoint. Earlier, we used to work on the SharePoint Designer to make this happen, but now it's even more simpler. Even if you have the copy command in SharePoint, it's not going to serve the whole purpose, right? So even if it creates a copy of the page, the content and layout is lost. Again, you know, it's, it's not a recommended option. So how do you do this? So I'm going to go ahead and show it on my screen. So the next time when you're going to make a copy of a SharePoint page, it's going to be, you know, you can do it in less than two minutes. So I'm just going to demonstrate this feature. So the first thing what you need to do is navigate to the site pages document library. So I go to my gear icon click on site contents and then I scroll down further to site pages as you see here so now I can see my site pages here I go and click on it all right now I have my site pages over here and I need to make a copy of this right so what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on one of the files and then I have two ways to copy it either by clicking on this site panel it says copy to, right? Uh, the classic view will be only able to see a copy command, which is not going to help anymore. Or I can also right click over here. So you need to click on copy to. And then I get a site pop up saying that, you know, I need to copy one item. Now don't change the destination location. So you just have to simply click on copy here. What happens next? You get a copy of the page with a suffix one at the end. All you need to do is rename it. So I'm just gonna click on the Epsilon button and then I click on rename. All right, now I have my site renamed. Now, simply I'm just gonna click on it. There you go, it works. See, this is my new site. And it's actually made a copy of this. So this is my new site and it has actually created a copy of this. If I want, I can customize it further. Easy, isn't it? So that's what I really wanted to discuss for today. So thank you so much for watching this video. I'll be coming out with more and more SharePoint related videos. So stay tuned. Have a great weekend.